Welcome back to the channel, everybody. Hello. We are here for some more Squishmallow goodness. Hooray. I found these guys, and I don't have them. So <laughs> I thought, why not? Uh, they were right next to the Blacklight Clown selection, which I do have. Whoa. And Whoa. I'm kind of hoping because of the high price point that these two are Blacklight Glow Fun. But I, I, I don't know. Yes. So in this series, we can get a Cthulhu, Hooray. a Yeti. It looks like a fruit bat, a vampire cow, <laughs> a strawberry cow, and a Yeti clown. No, it's a killer clown. Killer clown? Gotta watch out. I don't know. You to oblivion. Either way, it looked neat. And I thought, um, why not? That was the first Squishmallow I bought, remember? It was like this big. Yes. I was like, oh my goodness. He's up Cthulhu? there. You actually have a different version. Yours is a, a light blue version. This is the dark green version. Oh, well, there's anyway. there's many. There's many. Um, well, well done, Mystery Squad. My interest has peaked for the first time. There you go. Boop, boop, boop. All right. Look, look at how disturbing he is. So these do have the cheat holes in the bottom. <laughs> um, this one looks purple and sparkly. Uh, none of these look purple. None of these look sparkly. They look purple. This oh, one holes. looks pink. <laughs> the cheat holes definitely don't always work. Ooh, that one looks green. That one. Let's start. Let's start. Scissors, let's and, do this. And uh, this one is purple. So good luck, everybody. Let's do this. Let's do it. Dun, da, da, da. <gasps> oh, here and already. The video. We win. Hello, <laughs> Noro. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, Great. No, That's... I got that out of my system now. Great. Hey. Now let's take a look at you, friend. Whoa. All right, so here we have a <laughs> tentacly monster with wings. So he, this can only be Cthulhu. And he did him right with the rosy cheeks. And he looks really what? good. <laughs> yeah, um, he does. There's a tail. <laughs> and uh, obviously a soft, squishy goodness that is our Noro. <laughs> now, for those of you who want to know, there you go. Squish date, numbers, story. Pause here. And for those of you who don't care, there you go. There he was. Brittany, welcome him in. <sighs> that not dead, which can eternal lie. And strange he is, even tough to die. There, are you happy? Mm, you could have put a little bit more panache into it, Brittany. I'll panache you in the face. She probably will, everybody. <laughs> she probably Get will. Him. All right, so there's Cthulhu. That's Brian's new best friend. Yeah, yeah. I call him all the time. He expects the call of me. Okay, well, I am hoping to find a new best friend of my own, so let's see who else we have. Is it going to be as evil as me? Hey, buddy. I'm, thanks. Are you really I'm evil? Little, I'm a little bashful, see? Like my rosy cheeks. Yeah, but I mean, you're I'm not adorable. evil. Cthulhu's I'm not necessarily evil, right? Um, Yeah, it's a gaze upon me causes madness. That's why that unicorn girl just stayed the same. That explains a lot about her, actually. <laughs> oh! Oh! Ooh, wiggle, 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 wiggle. Well, I'm glad Cthulhu um, didn't yeah. cut across the top of that one. <laughs> You didn't even make him talk. Rude. Uh oh. Who was I supposed to make talk? The bag? Didn't you? Say oh wow! That is some fluff. Whoa. Whoa! Hello, clown yeti friend. Oh, very soft though. Okay, so really cute yeti in a party hat with a lot of extra fluff. Hold on, just let me just defuzz. Defuzz his hat. There we go. Oh, Whoa. Um, now I have all this. Whoa. Okay, so he looks great. So we have a Yeti with, uh, like, a Bozo the Clown nose. Perfect. <laughs> and uh, some lovely lashes. His fuzz is great. Super fuzzy. <laughs> and in a clown jumper. And the collar. <laughs> uh, so here... <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> here we have Yakaterina. One more time. Yakaterina. Bless you. Mm -hmm, thank you. And everything you might want to know. There you go. Oh, a tax accountant. I could use one of those. That'd be great. Maybe she could help me out. <laughs> there you go. That's not true. You said the second scariest thing was clowns. Hold on. Hold on. Like, you said I was the first. Beans. Whoa. This Yeti has beans. <laughs> well, that's great. So we have a Yeti clown with beans. I yep. like it. Yep. I like, I wear a collar and I got buttons in my jumper, but like. The beans are the best part. Yeah, it looks like socks that you wear a lot. Oh, ow, no, hold on. <laughs> Thank you. <gasps> Look at the Yeti beans. Oh, it's great. You can leave footprints everywhere you go, and people will always question. Good yeah, stuff. It's, it's actually a good idea. So, like, if he's, like... I mean, it's not hunting the hoed egg, but I guess you could search for the Yeti clown. But, I mean, like, if he's, like, committing an axe at, like, you know, the circus... What? Like, people are going to follow the footprints and be, like, bear. Oh, all right. Well, well planned out. 
Is that a bear print? That, is <laughs> that a bear print? That's not a bear print, is it? This is barefoot, right? Hmm, valid point. Or is it in a jumper? Is he in like a, <laughs> is she in like a jumpsuit? I don't know, but it's creepy and fuzzy, I have a lot of questions, great. and I don't care. So far, we've cute. opened two, and this is hands down the best Mystery Squad series ever, bar none. If you disagree with Brian, put your complaints into the comments below and proceed to get blocked. Whoa! <laughs> no. We only block a few people here. <laughs> you guys say something pretty terrible you get blocked. Here you go. Okay. Um... Oh, be, hey, oh, Why, hello! <laughs> I'm a m mushroom bat. Mushroom bat? Uh, definitely a bat. Um, uh, but no <laughs> chomps. But chest hair. But extra fluff. And, <laughs> uh, oh. Cosmo. Mm, there we go. And Cosmo. here is everything you wanted to know. Does it say what it is? Wow, that was kind of rude. I don't think you can just ask that question like that. And no, they very rarely do. <laughs> All right, and there you go. So those of you who don't care what it says, that's fine. I care what it says. Well, we write a, a weekly column for the local paper. It's Whoa. very important to keep Whoa. print alive. Is it? And uh, this edgy mushroom writes a weekly column in the local paper and never holds back honest opinions. Huh. So Why, just editorial? Um, I do appreciate an opinion <laughs> and a positive or negative review based on your experiences. I'd say adorable. Well, thanks. Thanks. I'm trying to get a pulsar. Welcome mushroom yeah. bat. Yeah, I also do mushroom like traffic bat? updates because I can fly. Well, that probably makes it easier. Well, it doesn't really make it easier because I just do print. Like, I mean, those the, TV guys. Yeah, so you're a little out of... Your info gets out way faster. Yeah, I mean, I guess you would be a little bit behind if you're doing especially traffic updates. Well, and we're just a small local town paper. We only publish every Wednesday. You wow. Okay. Um. I mean, there's still I get a lot to be said for this. I don't think there is. Well, it's a mushroom bat. <laughs> Cute and great colors like that pink it's and purple. A mushroom bat. No, no further questions. None. I have I have no questions for Cosmo. No questions. Thank you. Welcome, Cosmo. And our very last. Oh, this went too fast. I'm sorry. Went too fast. The last mystery squad member is. You don't get to handle me if you don't make me talk. I can't make you talk. We've been You've over this. Numerous times. <gasps> no. I have tried right, and ready? failed. I have failed numerous times. Oh, Whoa! Hey. Hello! Another Yeti. No dupes. I guess the uh, cheap holes work this time. This time. Look at these. Look at these. But like all purple, it's... Look at a, these. That's a tough nut to crack. <gasps> you got beans too! And a twofer. <laughs> okay. I do really like the fuzziness. Yeah, I like the Yeti set. The Yetis. The Yetis like or soft. Sasquatches, depending on which one you have. Sam Squanch. This is uh, Buna. <laughs> For everything you wanted to know, there is all you wanted to know about Buna. You can pause it there or not. Your choice. And What did that scene. say about garlic stick? <laughs> uh, well, she washes her hands constantly, so I think Buna and I could be besties. <laughs> and we also get... Uh... Oh, wow. She washes out of habit or just to relax. That makes sense. Hmm. And sometimes because she has garlic stuck to her fingers. Oh. So obviously she's some type of home cook. Buna only likes her homemade garlic bread and has a tray in the <laughs> oven right now. Don't forget Whoa. to wash up before dinner. Well, I like garlic bread. Uh, yeah, so Buna and I could be besties. I too like to make bread. Can I have some garlic bread? Of course, we'll, we'll make some later. Angry. Uh, but let's take a look. Yeah, we'll make some later, no problem. So here is a very fuzzy Yeti mm -hmm. with a twofer and some lovely purple velour and a uh, fuzzy blue <laughs> chest. Great chest hair. With purple beans. So there you go. I do like how they have variant levels of chest hair. Like, I don't really have a lot. Just a little peach fuzz. Little I, like how, I like how fuzzy the Yetis have gotten. <laughs> I'm blushing. Wow. That was a little much. <laughs> and there you go. So that was uh, this series of Squishmallows. If you know the, the squad's official name, please let me know because I don't. Creep and squad. I think we should see if, they're, if they glow in black light. I think we should mm -hmm. check. <laughs> I still love you. That's okay. Let me borrow. Let, here, hey, hey, you, come here. Wow. Okay, now we've crossed the line, and we're done. So we're not gonna check the black light. We're just gonna quit for the day. I wasn't gonna go you. And uh, if anybody wants that thing, <laughs> <laughs> just kidding. You can't have scissors. Now, what, should I check the glowability on these? Sure. Let's do it. Okay. Low ability. Whoa, oh, light down. I'm destroying the place. This is why we can't have nice stuff.
All right, welcome to my pantry, everybody. That's right, you're now in the pantry. And uh, kind of glowy. I would say glow. Mm, yeah. I would say definitely glow. Weird angle, but a nice bright pink. <laughs> um, And, oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Bright pink and bright red, and that hat probably glows <laughs> better, too. And the lighting is a little better. Not the best lighting, but definitely black light glow. And... Oh, just the chomper, really, in the belly on yeah, this no, one. Yeah, no, Not as much glow. Nope. And our Cthulhu. No glow at all. But his stomach would... Yeah, his cheeks glow a little. The stomach... Her stomach will glow. It's... Again, it's lighting. Yeah, go up. Here. Yeah, it's the lighting. Totally glowy. <laughs> you can see the neon green oh, on there yeah, and the yeah. pink. It's the lighting. It's a little wacky. But I would say these definitely look super fun under black light. Just my pantry <laughs> probably doesn't demonstrate it the best, but this is the best I can do right now. Oh, the Yeti's tummy does glow, which I guess is why we don't. Fun, glow yeah. Hold this on. is I not my perfect. Hands are blocking everything. Wow, we're professional. Mm -hmm. And let's end it here, shall we? Glowy, <laughs> great. Stop. Bye. <laughs> All right, so that was these squishmallows and under black light, and I would say yes, they glow. Yes. Just we could have represented that better, but it's daylight <laughs> outside, and I can only do so much with windows. All right, so, uh, and you got a tour of the pantry. You're welcome. Yeah, and it's time to reward the best one. We all know who's getting it. Not the mushroom green. <laughs> Can I help you? Why? Yeah. There you go. You and, win, Noro. You know, well, I would agree. We all knew that. I do love the Yetis, and I do love the bats, but I think that uh, our Cthulhu wins. Because <laughs> Cthulhu. And there you go. So if you are enjoying this very squishy content with interesting commentary at times <laughs> go ahead like comment subscribe and tell me what you think of these fabulous friends i think this might be my favorite series i would agree the mystery squads close runner up and there's like, like no bad ones in this <laughs> series i'd like to see a little bit more uh lovecraftian horror intermixed into the toy scene i think that's Good why stuff. we have that's why we have killstar yeah and that's all i got so thanks for watching bye